Hey knuckleheads, welcome back to Sis in the City. So by now, everyone should know that Sis is going to be on Bad Boys Club LA on the Zeus Network. Well, we're just going to get into the behind the scenes details a little bit, especially because Natalie Nunn went live today and discussed it a little bit. So let's see what happens, shall we? So I'm just going to replay the trailer and I want y'all to take a look at some of the comments that were left under this video on the Zeus app. I think it's safe to say that a lot of people are highly anticipating Sis's appearance on this show. But for someone who seems to eat, drink, and sleep fame, or fame chasing, he didn't seem too excited about it. So the trailer dropped Sunday night, which was February 27th, the night before his court date. And the next day in his live, people were congratulating him, asking questions, and here's his response. As you guys know, I'm gonna be hosting a reality show. Um, I'm going to be hosting a show um, that everybody watched during the day. It's a daytime show. Um, so, yeah, I haven't slept. Sure. <laughs> you guys just don't know. It's been so much good news happening for me right now, and I don't know what to say right now. And it's like when you're under contracts and when you're under stuff like that there's certain things you can't do and say so as you can see sis was ignoring all the bad boys club questions and pretending that he was going to be on some daytime talk show well natalie nunn and the owner of the zeus network lemuel Plummer, were on live today and they discussed the show a little bit how are you feeling you ready for bad boys yeah i'm excited like this the is cast is crazy lit Lit. There's so much going on with the cast. <laughs> like, they. Somebody said. Ready. Somebody. Somebody said Andrew said he's not on the show. Andrew? No, I have a video where he said he was on the show. Yeah. He's you, on. You, he's on the show. Yeah. You guys will see. Who's the person on my video right now? Are you seeing when I do this? Um. Who am I missing? I will answer some of your guys' questions in a second. Um, oh my God, so I said, oh, oh yeah, Andrew. <laughs> Natalie, duh. All right, Andrew Caldwell. Um, <laughs> Andrew Caldwell, Andrew Caldwell, Andrew Caldwell. A big personality, a lot of you guys know, I've been, you know, uh, kind of tapping in with Andrew. Um, he sent in, he, he wanted to be on the show, he sent in a tape. Um, he kept following up, following up, following up, following up, following up. <clears throat> and, um, oh wait, yeah, Andrew, and then there was one other person I forgot. Oh, I saved one for last, because now it just clicked in with me. Um, Andrew, he, um, he was, uh, uh he's a bad boy, so don't let, that's the thing, you know, the church people be the worst ones! <laughs> I said it. 
said it. Yeah, I said it. The church people be the worst ones. Okay. Um, and then we do have um replacements, but we're going. We won't talk about that right now. And no, I did not know. Andrew Caldwell. This is a great first season cast. I think they, they overly delivered. Um, and you guys are going to be in for an amazing season of nonstop greatness. That's what I can say. Entertainment and greatness. Then I'm getting a lot of questions about like who's um, gay, who's straight. I really don't think that matters. But I mean, obviously, it's going to, a lot of that will be talked about on the show so um you'll you guys will see a lot of that like but no the cast is not all one particular you know race or one particular gender or one particular you know i tagged all the boys yesterday on my instagram post so go check it out let me know um if you see all that I, the only person i couldn't tag was Andrew Caldwell, but you guys can find him in the thing, Andrew Caldwell. I think just nobody, nobody, you know, I'm, I'm gonna say less, but. Now sis, why aren't you going black Natalie? Did you do something you were ashamed of maybe? So here's sis on Monday speaking about the show, but pretending not to really speak about the show. Give me, give us some time. <laughs> to address some things, you guys. Everybody keep asking me different things. Give me some time to address. Do not subscribe to anything. Do not purchase anything. Give me some time to address some things and it will be dealt with, okay? Please, I cannot speak on nothing until my lawyers give me an okay. Do not purchase anything with my name on it. If there's anything with my name on it, do not purchase nothing. Do not follow nothing. Do not subscribe to nothing. You heard it from my mouth. Do not subscribe to nothing. Do not support, please. Um, yeah, the cat's already out the bag, sis, and not only have I subscribed to Zeus, but I made sure to add it to my list so I won't miss a single solitary second of your premiere. So, sis went live today, and he doubled down on his position on the show. Okay? I'm not a part of anybody that's gay. I don't support that community, and my voice will be heard, but there's certain things I can say and cannot say. And I need to block this person from coming on here spreading lies again. I, I don't know who you talking. I didn't fall out. I can't fall out with somebody who I don't know. Well, sis, if you indeed did sign a contract, I would suggest you keep your big black mouth off of your employers. I mean, I could be wrong, but it's not wise to bad mouth the people that are cutting you a check especially if you don't receive said check until the reunion. Now I'm gonna post the full live from today so you can see his extended rant. And I look forward to reading you guys' comments. Anyway, till next time, knuckleheads.